Sin City. What the fuck are you doing on my corner? You know, I've been here since 1926. <laughs> the first job I had was doing Jesus. No, You're on my corner, you ho bag. Get the fuck out of here. Get out of here. Get the fuck off Get my out. corner. What is that? An old dick that you're eating? Wow, you've really got your standards low. I bet your pussy looks beat up like a grapefruit thrown against the window screen of a moving 4x4 vehicle. Oh, Get the fuck out of here. I love the drama. What's up with your face? Wow, is that what your asshole looks like? Prolapsed? <laughs> that is the most disgusting thing I've ever seen in my That's life. What your face looks this like. This bitch is over here. I work the street corner of Sin City. This is my street since 1921. I need you to fuck off down there, down you mean the street. 1721. Because you should be dead by now. I don't give a fuck if I should be dead or alive. This is my corner, bitch. It's not your corner. It is my corner. There's my name right there. Old bag bitch. That's me. Whoa. Come on, do one. Your beef curtains are like hanging on the corner. You're so old. That's why I'm the is number that, one. The guys that is why like I'm the number rug. one ho. Cardi B took her tips from me. Nothing more. What's that stink? Exhilarating. Legs 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 I'd rather look at my fingers than look at your fingers. I think you should smell your face. fingers, Fishcake McGee. Get out of here. This is my corner spot. Ugh. You know yeah. what I hate more than a whore? Is the one who won't get off my fucking corner and who's eating a rusk. Take my Fancy cigarettes. a bit of a hobnob, do you? Why are you talking to me? Because you need to get a fuck of my corner. Fucking annoying. You're chasing all the customers away. Look, even the devil here is smoking on it. What you got to say for yourself, girly? What's your name? Prolapse Penelope. I'll make both of you slap the deal. Point. Shut up. What? Why don't you? What? Why don't you two slaps Jeez, do a granny porno? Tapping? Fuck. Why don't you two slaps do a granny porno? And if you watch and film it, I'll make you famous. Why don't you two lesbians scissor each other I'm and fly devil. off into the sky? Bye. I'm the devil. Who did your hair? Peter Parker after he had his head blown off. Mm -mm. Who? Oh my god. Look at those legs. John Travolta did it. John Travolta? Oh mm. really? John Travolta. Volta. That fucking slut. You know what we need her. here? We need a vicar. We need someone of holy spirits to talk some sense into Anyone this. Anyone got coke or blow? What's happening here? Hold on, take what's my happening? fucking... Take it oh, away. Look, it's the Take it away. Watch, Don't burn yourself. What's what's happening here, lady? Well, look here. See, well, the devil here's on the corner, and he's not talking any sense. Hey, what's up, Dale? What's up, Dale? Well, hello there. You okay, Jesus. Dale? How you doing? I'm not Jesus. That's oh. Uh, oh, fuck off, then. Get the fuck out of here. You seen? You seen this little bitch? What business do you have in Sin City, Mister Vicar? Well, Christo. I'm here. Uh, Clean oh, oh, Get that God. shit away from me. Smells like poo. Holy water. Oh, it's toilet water. Oh, oh my god. god! I don't know what's going on. I think you need to stand here so everyone can see. This is Sin City. Going on. Oh my Sin god. City. Is that your child? Oh my god! Oh wow! You're a fucking a sick slut. Last time I'm asking you to babysit for me. You're a fucking oh, no, wait. sick slut. I think this is your abortion. No, it's you. Oh, wait, it's got your cum stain on it. Pull it off. Pull it off. Oh, it says mm -hmm. Penelope. It's got a ton products. of condoms on it. Look, what's the brand? Direct. Definitely. Oh, it's squirted on. You know I do it raw dog style. I, I don't wear yours. any plastic. Raw dog style. Yeah. No, you don't wear plastic. You I'm wear like, hey. fucking knitted scarves as condoms. Yeah. Of course, yeah. I knit my own condom. I just yeah. want to introduce condom. the world to you in Sin City. So I like to make a visit from time to time on the Ladies devil. and gentlemen, we are in Sin City tonight. You know I what that just means. Explain Anything goes. What the hell's going we on? We are having banana parties. I just want to say. Sausage fiestas. You're and a great slut. And the vicar slut. is going to show us how to hide a pineapple the between slut. the cheeks. Exactly, cheeks. you're a good Isn't slut. Right, you shut your vicar? trap and you get busy. She Why doesn't shut up. Why did you read us a verse from the babal? <laughs> oh my god. He's it's sneezing a so much, here, the mate. holy water's gone to his asshole and brain. Message. <laughs> it's coronavirus! Oh That's God. a slut, man! A is a from, from that God. is a hooker in disguise dressed up as a holy man. You know how you tell him the devil? Look at these two sluts I'm wearing right here. Soap girl slut hmm. merch. And this slut over here is the best <laughs> bitch I ever met. Her back is hunched into a hunchback bless from all the time she's taken to bring her back. And you, what? shut up, you're the worst hooker I've ever met in my life. 
I've still got the mood. <laughs> Show me what you've got. This is Show me what you've got. I don't think you're a hooker. I think you're a liar, Pinocchio. Oh, don't Pinocchio. Don't bitch. Oh, you fucking bitch. Fuck it. Fight. Fight. Oh, my God. I nearly fell. I tell you now, you make me break a leg in these, and I will have you sued, and I'll have you off the streets. You'll never work again. Mm, Are you sure that that's... Uh, Oh. Not a STDs Where all over you your face. There, mate? You are an STD. Where are you going now? Wow. Sure. I'd like to uh, conduct a two minute interview with both of you street hookers. Yeah, yeah, tell them hookers what to do. First off, for you, Granny. Um, yes, what? Just Baby. To... Oh, I mean, sorry, love you. <laughs> What do we do with this Come here, please. Come you. What do we do with this baby? Come on, move up, bitch. Stand here. Come on, come on. Stand up. We're going to have a snap down, bitch. Are you a vicar or are you a priest? Listen here, baby. What are you? What are you? I'm both. Come on. A vicar and a priest. Can you put this thing back inside one of these? Why is the baby Have you ever done a doggy style with your own foot? What's happening? Have you ever done a doggy style with your own foot? Tell me. What's your doggy style? Well, I can show you. You, you, come here, whore. Be part of the Lord, I'll show you right? What dog is. So, get down on the floor. You're supposed you to be the Lord, some right? Food, some kibble. Excuse How? me, I'm How trying to talk. Is your to asshole. I'm trying to stretch. talk. Shut up, whore. You said people are forgiven if they do bad things, right? Oh God. Isn't that what God's about? <laughs> no. Then who the fuck are you, then? Oh, I'm not God. Then who street are hooker. You? You're a hooker. <laughs> no, you a street hooker. <laughs> <laughs> I came here to bless you, motherfucker. I thought you was a holy Listen, man. I don't know if you're. I thought you was I a holy man. Then why are you dressed up? I don't know if you're goddamn shit, motherfucker. I thought you was a holy Listen man. Listen here, slut. I know you mean taking that dick in your fucking ass in your mouth and your vagina all day. I know you fucked a kid this morning for breakfast. Oh my god. <laughs> you fucking. <laughs> That's I told you it's a fake typical. bitch. She's got a wig on. It's a fake bitch, man. Hey, <laughs> about her her nails. You can tell she's had her lips done too. Oh, fake. that dick her fucked her hair off. Lips, All man. those boobs are fake. Too. Did you fuck this poor child as well? No, come on. No, man. <laughs> That's fucked up. That's next no, level fucked up. Oh you my lying. god. Check it out. <clears throat> Ready I knew you visited open. Africa. Ready and open, available. Oh my god. Because <laughs> it's the. Uh, She's uh, so excited she can't even pull up her pants. Close your legs, oh! Are, are you a holy man? Yeah, no, that's what he I was likes asking. To hold, no. What is this guy? Can you answer me? No, he yeah, puts I holes can. in what man. What is he? We've got he business puts holes to in man. I no. tell people what to do. The wrong, I tell them to do it all. Do are you cook, a, a do priest? prostitutes. Do. Is he a pastor? Oh, yeah, yeah it makes him feel good. And exactly. Then, he's gonna so he's, in he's not him. a real pastor. I asked him, can I be forgiven I'm not for pastor. doing bad shit? Pastor's what you eat spaghetti. Oh, man, to that. <laughs> <laughs> now, I just want to say this. As the devil, we are in good business together. As the devil, you can take the mic if you want to. As the devil, you can take a big, large dick if you want to. Looks Fine, like you're ready, dude. This microphone looks hey. big enough. Hard it enough. This fucking whore. It's it on. on. Now, Can I just say what? I've got an important message. Anybody out there that is looking to have a good time, call 1 800 idogranny.com. Also, they used to call me Betty Davis. Something about my eyes. Have you guys seen. Thank you. Enjoy your evening. Why is there some awkward silence now? Have you guys seen Dateline NBC with what? Chris Hansen? The devil has now entered the building. I would like to say... Hey! No. Can I no. please say something? No, 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 no. That's this the terrible the thing world. about these whores. They just grab, grab, grab. No! Right. I just want to say I'm one I'm the devil! Thing. It doesn't make sense Can that I you got the thing? devil voice! Do you not? I don't have a devil voice. This. You will if you talk with that mic. Well, can't take another well, take possession. Possess me. Possess me. No. no. Oh, possess, possess me. Possess me. Okay, and let me bend talk over. I'll possess you. Whenever I say bend over, I'll possess you. Let me possess Yo, you. Get away from me, you old bitch. <laughs> Go hang up your grapes. Go. <laughs> <laughs> What? I'll make great no, juice with you. Take down the damn fucking right. You want my whole show. Don't you want to possess me? No. Don't you want to possess me? Possess me. I'm a dirty slut. Possess me. I think this is where we stop doing this shit. Someone needs to possess me. Say that again. No. He Why said, would I'm a that? dirty slut. Possess me. I've never heard such a sexual thing. Well, give me <laughs> From my own brother. Come on, Mr. Give me the mic. Take down the mic. Is it on? We need to make sure this mic's on, or it's not going to be will put effect. it on for you. I never met such a hoe. Stupid bitch. Hello. I hate you. 
Is it on? Hello. I've got the power of God. God. Oh, Vicar, you look He's so coming. sad in your little I've got a question. Hello, okay. Has anyone seen yeah. Chris Hansen's show? Because no. Chris Hansen, we got him. Who's the guy? <laughs> Who the fuck is Chris Hansen? Sounds like someone I did in 1926. Dateline, NBC. Oh. oh. <laughs> He's a pastor. He's got to be a predator. Oh my God. Look at those glasses. He's hiding the big pupils. Oh Show us those creepers God. then. Come on. Come on, Mr. Pastor. Why are you sweating so much? Shut up, you old slut. Why does oh. Pastor start now, with the same thing as last night. You were calling me Daddy. Le Ooh. What? Oh my God. What happened? <laughs> you know what he just said? Who? <sighs> what did he say? <sighs> Why does Pastor <sighs> sound? The same as pedo, it starts at the same level. <laughs> it's not oh, funny. Oh no, look, the pastor's thumb is coming off the Bible. Oh. You know what that means? Hey. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Wait! Are you also going to cricket matches? <laughs> <laughs> You like to come, come on, man. I don't need no Give pussy. Give us a nice break. I don't need no pussy, man. So how I just want to say one thing. One eight hundred. Do the granny dot com. That is my website. Also, I do have fans only online. They are not naked pictures <laughs> because the camera would not. Um, I just want to envelope see. my Why is my big But anyway, hope you have a beautiful <laughs> night. Enjoy your grapes and your wine. Okay, let me just set the record straight. Set it straight. Shut up. You know, yes. you're a fucking whore. Thank you so much. We asked you kindly to be here, and all you did was ruin it. You won't even make it to hell. You're gonna be sucking dick forever. Thank you. I think we all knew that when she was born. With that mouth. Look at her. Look at her. Look at yourselves. I'm just that joking. Dirty, look at that lipstick dirty. smudged always. She's not even wearing lipstick. It's just from sucking dick so much. I suck dick for protein. Suck. I gotta build muscle. The sperm's got a lot of protein in there. That is oh the most truest thing I've ever heard in my life. It's so true. You should see the muscle in my ass cheeks from all the beautiful creamy custard I have on oh a daily basis. Oh my god. Fucking hell. And I thought I was fucked up. Mr. Vic over here is actually my number one customer, and so is she. Oh. Wait, he's your number one customer. Of course. Yes. He loves the old then granny the, grapes. Then he where, loves sucking on these raisins. If he's your titties. customer, where yeah. does he get the time to play ball at all those cricket matches? He doesn't play ball. <laughs> he plays bad. Badminton. Big bats. Large bats. Bad bats. Big bats. Black bats. Mm. He does it all. What is this, a uh, 1,000 question with the vicar and the brazo? I don't know. Well, what? She doesn't want to repent her ways. Duh. This is why you don't give brazos a mic. Exactly. <clears throat> vicar. Because they start Ooh. sucking on it. Vicar. Ooh. It's a very, very bad man. Oh my god. Very bad. <laughs> Why did it touch you in all your fuzzy places? Show us places? on the dolly where it touched you. Show us. He gives me Charlie Sheen vibes. Oh my god. Look at the stains on his soul. What? <laughs> did you take no cards tonight, Mr. Vicar Man, I think it's time that you give a sermon to this church yeah. here. Come on, take it away. All right. Get the power and spirit in you. Praise the Lord. Wait, 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 wait. You're not trying to be Stevie Wonder now, because that would be a real crime. <laughs> I thought you were done with this. <laughs> Come on. Take away the unholy sins. Tell her all the sins that You're he's done in his life. Bitch. Come on, do it. That he's confessed to you, all the sins. Come on, tell him. Come on, tell him about I don't know much about him. I don't know much. Stuff. Come on. All of these bitches here on the line are people that Sam has fucked. All these sluts. Guinness vegan. You open your legs so wide, I thought you were an umbrella. Virgo Quinn, you gave us 
I taste the wildland. Nigel Mason gave me the best rim job I've ever had. Rob Grimes oh. gave us the best crabs in LA. And then Scott, Scott Smith. Smith. Oh, the best naked blue waffle to ever eat was at his house. Daryl Lammyman. There was nothing lame about he that He rode man. naked on a llama and fucked his mom. Oh, Jeff and Collins. Jeff Collins. Don't get me started on that rodeo. He wrote the dictionary on dicks. Thomas Kumka had a little oh. time with the little frazzo over here with the, what's it called? The Thomas Kumka starred in the most granny pornos you've ever seen. And Andrew Ball had a one-on-one -on -one with the vicar that lasted three hours. I wonder what they spoke about. They spoke about Christ and good times. Patrick Soul had no soul by the time that the brother was finished with him. Patrick Soul? Then John Soul Kovacs. is soul to the devil! John Kovacs has the biggest bollocks you've ever seen in your life. We thought it was a tumor. But it's not, it's his bollocks. Beverly Hassel. Beverly Hassel has she the biggest is. booty shaking babunga you've ever seen in your life. She does a strip tease that knocks your mind out. And then Dai Kikuchi, well. There's not much to say other he than... He rides naked in the streets of Tokyo on a bike. This is oh, very Harley true. Davidson flashing zap signs at grannies. And Nathaniel White, well, yes. he's everything white when he's done. Knocking on them doors like Jehovah. Whoa. Peter Kent. Peter Kent is smoking it up through the... Ken White. Living life in the fast lane. No, he does cocaine on the... Assholes of grannies. Paul Garton leaves nothing on, and Tom House, while well, he just wears a thong, Mark Banner and he leaks like a carton. Roger Comley. Roger Comley tried to jizz at a star. He almost reached there. And Julie Crosskery, well, when she walks in the streets, everybody's head's turn. Rob Crizel, he's the one that you watch out for in the dark alley. He's got the biggest cucumber you've ever had in your Mark life. Mark Weston, he's got a huge dick. And Laura Hain, well, you better watch out for that pussycat. Whoa. Then there's Sharon Picard. She shoots darts out of her. her. Be very careful. She shoots darts out of her guava. That is very They'll true. They'll paralyze you. And Masaru Kikuchi. Also runs naked through the streets, shouting, Fuck you! I fuck everyone! What? Then there is Aaron Nunag. Aaron Nunag rode a donkey to town backwards with guns blazing. From his arsehole. Yes. Kenneth Vegan also carries coconuts in his bumhole. Just it's to quite make it a bigger. Sight, really. And not a vegan when it comes then to... Then Carl Perkins sex. keeps things perky, doesn't he? He likes to put Ice hard blocks wood his on his floors. Ian Hopwood paints the house with a cream-colored, pasta-based, what is that thing? Dick Starch. sauce. Yes. Michael Johnson, they call him Mikey Johnson. Do you know why? He has a monsoon of juice. Everywhere, exactly. Rich Drury. He likes to rob people and cause pain. Fintan Water likes to do the doggy style on the carpet. When I say doggy <laughs> style, it means wiping his bum hole on the carpet all over the house. After he took it. Yes. Roy Ridge well, likes to party it up. Roy Ridge likes to shine up his head and look through every crevice he can find. Then there is Izzy Dreary. We're well, not going to say anything to her. She's a child. She's a child, be but you better rough. not be a slut. I'm just joking, Izzy. Sorry about that. And Adam Coombs, well, he has a cock home like you've never seen before. He combs it. He combs his Michael own Michael Gold, the bold and bald. Okay. Michael Gold starts more pornos than you. Tahir also, well, what can we say about this man? He wanted an insult last night, now we're gonna give it to him. His bum hole is so red and raw that even a baboon gets jealous because true. he could like a mat on his ass He does dry. every kind of porno imaginable. Christopher Knapp. Well, he's been stripping so hard in the pole, he's got pole burn. And Daniel Fuller, he's Daniel been bending Fuller. over backwards since the day he was born. No, that sounds very fucked up. That is very true. Wait, as soon as he turned 18, he didn't stop moving backwards. And Lionel Leventhal. The naughty well, lion himself. The naughtiest lion of all. He likes to. The day he was circumcised, he wore the foreskin on his head as a hat. It was quite the fetching thing to see. I was Everybody say, else had fancy yamakas. His was homemade. I thought you were going to say he shaved his balls and turned into a scarf. Oh. Well, that's pretty cool, too. Then there's Ian Abbott. Well, he's got the most fucked up porno I've They call ever him seen. Robocock. They call him the Bot. Chris Slater, slaying arseholes since 1923. Oh. Ask his mother. Alex Waringer, 
knitting jerseys out of the seams of others. Chris Maudsley only likes bratwurst. Ask him why. Jelly Hankinson milks goats. David Bell. Why. David Bell milks pigs as well as the neighbor's titties. He still breastfeeds. Aaron Pap likes to make porridge out of people's body fluids. And then Peter Canty <laughs> wears people's panties on Peter his head. Peter Canty snuck into my house and stole all my brother's lingerie. And Cornelis Kasbergen likes to make a cheese mountain. Out of eggs. Scott eggs. Sobrania. Sobrano. Scott Sobrano. Um, likes to set bras on fire and beat his stick. Rick Freeman, I would tell you things about him, but he would be arrested if I said it. Well, I'll tell you what he did. He robbed a store of vibrators, and he's using one right now. Craig Walkenhorst. Can't even walk after the horses he rides. He's ridden Sam a few times. <laughs> That's hey, Butler, one big stallion I've got to tell you. Let's kill it. I still walk with a limp. Oh. oh bitch over here. Also, if we insulted anyone good, I hope you cry, you little fucking bitches. Welcome Sorry. to Sin City. <laughs> the only one I will apologize for is the one we said about Izzy Drury. It's okay. Tom House, Tom Tom House that we said right the Tom House whore, the biggest whore of the house. Exactly. <laughs> Welcome to Sin City, where dreams are made, people are shaved, and, and, and beds are slayed. Beds are broken. Oh, cool. Like, we so got no whores, s'mores, and oh, dirty there is a song, you little slut. You're gonna stay. This is the theme song for Sin City. Please, Mr. DJ, put, put it on. Put the fucking music on. Thank you. Anyone watching tonight offended? Good. We already started. Wait till later. Are you fucking ready? Yeah, I am, brother. Bring it on. Hey. 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 Take your mother along for me. Say hello to your mother for me. <laughs> Tell your mother hello for me. Shut up. Tell your dad hi too. I got his pubes in a purse. Down a pussy purse. This DJ sucks. <laughs> Hey there. Better than this over here. Hello. I just want to say, you've got the most beautiful cheekbones. You look like the inside of a fucking unwashed vagina. Ew. Hit play. That's play it. it. Come on. Play that Funko music. And close your legs. Camera hole. <laughs> we are going to be very offensive. It's okay. Oi. No. This is Demon. the time. To be who you want to be. Oh, it's off now. <laughs> I think.
This is a nanny state. What? Whoa. Hey. Oh my god, that's the most expensive. It was that shit I've ever heard. Fucking hell. Okay, we're gonna do one more. Nah, we do it tomorrow. I just wanna say one thing. Oh, I have to open my mouth. Ooh, yeah, you're good, son. I wanna possess you. I wanna possess you. I wanna possess you. <laughs> I think you need to exercise this slut. Okay. You can exercise her. Goodbye. Thanks for getting the fuck off my car. I want to exercise that slut. Did you hear that? My God. Careful. I could have raised a burn. I can make some cash. <laughs> there, um, there are these steel trap <laughs> nipple clamps that I've been wanting since. God knows when. I've been saving up for so long. So finally I can... I don't think I have razor burn, but you never know. But I'm just saying, I careful when you come out to the garage of someone. Today was not my hair removal day. Thank you. Just have a saying. beautiful evening in Sin City tonight, ladies and gentlemen. What? Take it away with the number. At first, I was afraid what? I was petrified. Kept thinking, thinking about this war and such here by my side. There were so many fucking nights and so many big dicks. I will survive. Okay, thank you. Come back to the song. The minute you walked right in me, I could tell you were a real big friend of Oh my god. It's so funny. Every time I sing, the mic goes down. When she sings in a fucked up voice, you still leave it on. What a cunt. Because you're a slut and you need to shut up. You know what I think? I think you suck, asshole. That's what I think. <laughs> That's what I think. I shot at you, dolls. Shut up. No amount of glitter could make you pretty. <laughs> Who said I wanted to be pretty? Ever seen a vagina? You look just like one on your face. Thank Why you. do you think so many people love me? Exactly, they all want a piece of that tart. Exactly. Yeah, fucking rancid strawberry tart. You know, you could have had a milk tart today for 14 rand, but this bitch was like, no. Your ass doesn't need it. It does. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. Okay, then okay. fine, whatever. I'm going to be reborn in a second. Yeah, yeah. Thank you so much, Sharon, for tuning in. We hope you guys have a brilliant time. Also, we will be offensive in the show at Sin City after all. Welcome and we've to left Sin it open City. to interpretation. So, yeah. Thank you. And again, if we did offend you with the name calling in that, well, grow up. Man, I'm the most childish motherfucker I ever seen. So I'm gonna make a joke about my name. I cry laughing. I got teeth and beating at school for my name. So shut up. Thank you. Oh, Miss Camille. <laughs> shut up. Oh, Miss Camel. I'll fucking beat you. I'd like some Camille tea, please. Oh. I'm just sipping oh. on Camel meal. You know what I'm gonna do? What you gonna do? I'm gonna take you down to the store. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna shoplift and put it in your bag and say that horse stole. I thought you were gonna take me. You'll go to prison. I thought you were gonna say you're gonna take me down to the pawn shop and trade me in for for your DVDs. Holes. You know how many DVDs this slut's got? None. Uh, I took them all for my own personal usage. This baby has hung <laughs> itself with my guitar cable. It's love my playing so much. Oh my God, Red makes us laugh. He's such a little shit. He gets in these foul moods and then he doesn't wanna. <laughs> Play nice uh, prostitute and then he's rude. I say we starve him and he doesn't get any food and that way. Until he acts. In this house, we're all going to work. And he doesn't want to be a whore in this place, he's not gonna eat. You'll Unless it's dick. Rot. He'll eat dick when he's hungry. I'm just joking. <laughs> and you, nice glasses there. Good. It's a mist bitch to you. Actually, it's Mrs. Yeah, bitch. I married myself. Tell us, you know? Nothing. Nothing. He does. I got a pill of wisdom for you. Don't ever ask for a pearl necklace in a Chinese store. It's not a good color. Thank you. I've got a pearl of wisdom for you. Yeah, what? Don't put a pearl in your ass. Exactly. You'll shoot out an oyster. That is very true. Oh, listen to that. He's busy shouting out his nose. Fucking sick whore. I'm telling you now, it's coronavirus. Coronavirus online, please come down and collect this person. You know what Sin City is? Sex, drugs, and rock. It's fucking Elton John, mate. What? Sin City? Yeah. Betty and the Jets. <laughs> Betty. 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 Yeah. <coughs> Look at that whore. Are you Cockney. right? What? You feeling fine? Yeah. You. No, she's not coked up enough.
Look at her. So oh, who won the cricket match, Mr. Vicar? Your fucking fat ass. My oh, fat ass. Oh, 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 now I'm a fat bitch now, eh? <laughs> <laughs> I love how that hat uh, hides his bald spot. The vicar has been praying for a new hair job for the past 15 years. He even got a transplant from a kangaroo. Kangaroo's donger? No. No, it's a dingo's donger. I don't know. I just want to say this. Just want to say one thing, yes. What? In Sin City, when people go missing, just make them a cup of tea and they'll be fine again. Have a bit of a hobnob. Have a bit of a biscuit. What the fuck is Shoot that? Shoot him down, you fucking whore. Shut up, don't try to get political here. This is Sin City. Anything's possible except you. <laughs> you know, in Sin City, I make lots of people cups of tea. And they come round to my house. And I make them um, lovies. I make them kinds of beads and raisins and um, Jamaican loaves. Okay, you need to say the names in the fucking drawer. It's Sin City, you it's fucking, fucking Sin City. Oh. Yeah, are you, are you fucking ready? And again, I just want to say, we express our deepest gratitude to everyone whose name is on the line. Thank you so fucking much for supporting us, you guys are the fucking bomb. You're still a bunch of slaves, but I love you. But seriously, thank you. To not a sensitivity. The crest fall down. Look at that whore. She took all her hair down, but the whores on the floor. The crowds are there, fighting in the. What? I don't know. So, Sam, behind on the drums, you know, they filmed gorillas in the mist in your mouth shower when you were born. Hello. <laughs> and sometimes Sam is so dry in South Africa that Sam, they. That his breast milk comes out his farts. I sniff him. They smell like cabbage. Reminds me of home. <laughs> he looks confused. It's okay, Sam. I don't think the Vicar's having a good night tonight. Patrick so wow! Thank you, you get to hear win when you win the set just for this week's show. He's got a sneeze. Every He's time I sneeze, if someone uh, has committed a sin. You think you got Yeah! Play? Thank you, Patrick. Cool, Merci infiniment. Ready for the next one. Oh, Come listen on to mate. that. Go on there. Go <laughs> on. Yeah. Get it out, flat, let it out. Spit out your sins. Yo. <laughs> Close your legs. Close your legs here. Close your legs. I need more room for my legs. Woo! You get to choose a song for next week. Next week's show, you get to choose a song, you sluts. You I'm joking, you're not a slut. You're a fucking slut. Let's go, you're a super so, slut. Mr. Vicar there, you ready with that holy water? Wait. Hey, don't you dare spray your holy water from back there. I can feel the raindrops on your dick pill. Yeah. I can taste the crabs flying in the air. Coming right there through the screen. Okay, give it. Okay, come on, man. Come on, give me the fucking name. I thought you fucking had it. No, I didn't, mate. Hey, and on me. You get to choose for a song for next week's show. Thank you. Are you fucking real, You're a mate? fucking man for whore, Ed. Now, in this city tonight, for the very first time, we have a winner. What? Yeah, we'll always win this right here. Yeah, play it. I got a lane. Wow. Now I'm gonna get your name tattooed to my eyeball tonight by oh, this whore. This whore doesn't know how to do tattoos, but you're gonna stick a needle in my eye right aura. I was going to stick a needle in your bum hole, but then I realized it would get stuck. <coughs> Yeah, cause my ass isn't expanded like yours, sponge ass. It is not my fault. When I'm working, things are just falling into the bum hole. It is like a black hole. Uh, it's called bleach. You should really use it. Is that what happened to your face because your teeth missed that boot? 
No, I just like to smoke a lot and I like to drink a lot of drugs. So my teeth are a bit, not on the white side, but yo, your attitude. You could go to hell with it. If your teeth were a race, you would be black. I don't know what that fucking means, but I'm honored to be black. It means your teeth are <laughs> black. Oh, well, if you're gonna be a race, You'd be a horrible race from history, and I want to tell everyone who you are. You're the blue lizard, come faithful. Look at you, blue lizard eyes. The blue lizard people, they are the best. And you, you're the sneeze hole cunt. Is he spurring your cunt shit from your nose? Alright, are you ready? We are ready for the next next to be gone in Sin City tonight for the first time of the season of Sin beer? City. Hey. Who will be voted off? Who will stay? Who will go? And who will have their bum all stretched? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Who's got the fucking pen? Who am Monstilo? Give it! I told you my bum hole is like a black hole. It just swallows everything. The pen is up there. I'd like to formally distance myself. I take that back, she put the pen up her bum, you can see the ink coming from her eyes. I would like to formally disassociate with this prostitute. Um, I might be the devil, I do a lot of weird things, but I don't stick pens up my ass. You do, and I've seen it, and it's pretty amazing, but don't you touch my mic on the way I spit. You can have it. I can tell she has been scratching her brain eye because she has pink eye now. <laughs> Look at the pink eyes. She's been looking through dirty keyholes, watching little children on the toilet. Well, you are the most fucked up sicko I've ever met. I'm gonna tell you what you do. You film me watching people through keyholes and you put those videos up for your fan base, your only sick fans. And you know what? I love it. I'm just joking, don't touch my fucking mic, you sick sluts. Thank you. But the vicar is my number one subscriber. He likes to watch. Not a dirty fucker. He's not actually sneezing, he's orgasming. Oh. Every time he sneezes. Every time he sneezes, he just came out of his mouth. Oh. <laughs> out of every single oil in his body. It's called an orifice. Get your facts straight. Orifice. 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 Uh, could you please pass me a beer? <laughs> pass me a beer so I can rattle right. Let me pull it out my bum hole for you. Ah, uh, gross. <laughs> oh, did you hear that slut fart? I think she shot it. Hey. Hey. Who's got the pen? We are looking for the Just pen. Just the permanent marker, yeah. motherfucker. Stop the pen. Take it, take it. Who's the pen? Where is the pen? Where there it is. Where is the pen? She's we are looking for the pen. Where is the pen? We are looking for the pen. Looking for the pen. Come on, it's right there, you fucking slap it. Thank you. Mr. Vicker, give me an early beat like the one where Madonna was kissing the Jesus. The one living on a prayer, Bon Jovi. Give me a good religious beat, maybe like oh, Amazing Girls. Or maybe the one The Satan is Coming. Or Highway to Hell. Or maybe the Black Parade? Which is your favorite, Mr. Perster? What I want to pray for the bum hole? This one? I don't know, man. Me give me a beat, Mr. Perster. I'll fucking give you a beat. Hey, come on, come on. Look at that. You have one, your name, on the body, you know it. Oh my god, if I were you, I'd fucking scrub myself. Fucking all oh, have your name in her mind. You'll be fucked like a rotten banana on a peach. That is my favorite. <laughs> Fuck you, man.
Welcome to you would like to confess their sins, I would love to hear them. I'd like to find new things to try. I would like to know what the teacher has to confess. Shut up. The victim, the vicar once, please. The vicar once put a thermometer up his ass to measure how hot his bum cheeks are. Laura Hein! Sometimes when the vicar is tired at night, he wakes up. And then hook his crotch! How without a condom? Not so sexy, he's got 50 kids. This is true. 51 tonight, I can see into the future. It looks hairy. It keeps me falling because it's it looks hairy and full of disease. You've got a cook rot coming your way, rotten. Dick rot. Sometimes in Germany, in Deutschland, the dicker is coming to Deutschland, yes. And the only thing he is eating is bratwurst. It's very strange. Why is this, Mr. Vicker? Warum kannst du die Bratwurst essen? Hmm? No comment? You know what that means? Guilty yeah, as charged. I Welcome am. to Sin City, ladies and gentlemen. Tonight's I night is going to be a thrill. Tonight's first show is Charlie Brown. First song, sorry. Charlie Brown is written about sex, drugs, and rock and roll. Curb your addictions, or give other people a chance with a hoe. Thank you. And they have the drugs. I need some too. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Point. You wear a suit, you wear your chef outfit, we all know what you are. You're a baker, trying to bake some dough. <laughs> are y'all fucking ready? No. Yeah. Time for another drink, I think. Would you like some alcohol, Vicar? It'll make you feel good. Some liquor for the Vicar, make you feel quicker. Are you ready? To rock and roll and sincere. Fuck it out!
Shit too, and your dad. Say hello to your motherfucker. Say hello to your motherfucker. <laughs> Actually, if that bitch involves, say hello. Hello, Betsy. Liar. Say hello to your nana for me. Oh, let's go. What's wrong with me? I'm a liar. I couldn't see. Play with fire. Where did you go? Little did I know. Little did I know.
You don't know why properly. Alright, let's go. His stool. His drum stool. <laughs> and all of you are sitting on your charcoal tonight. I hope you hatch a good egg. <laughs> 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 Just stop the break now, 
Just for being yourself, this one goes out to you. Sometimes at night, I put uh, tin cans on my body and I melt them in Australian sun. And I think to myself, I'm what a societal reject. And uh, then the fire ends come on me and I bite my bum hole. It's quite a great experience, actually. You haven't had it done, you should have it done. And I'm a societal reject and I'm proud of it. So if you do fucked up things like that too, Please subscribe to me. I'll tell you about other things too. Have a nice moment, Sin City. The song Society's Reject and goes I'm out to you. Another base. So this fucking day. I know if you do really bad fucked up things, that does not make you a societal reject. That just makes you a fuck up. Yeah, don't blame everything on society. But if you don't want to be part of society, but you still, hey, we're all in this world together. Let's do this. Like the vicar on the drums. Doesn't like watching, washing his hands after having a big poo. That oh, doesn't make you something else. That doesn't make you a societal reject, mate. You're just dirty. Yeah. All right. Just so you know now. Woo! <laughs> Yeah, 
Fucking true. Hey, what's on my back? Oh, I know what it is. It's a good time. No, oh, are you fucking ready? Just want to say this: if you've never been to the house of fun, you're missing yeah, out. You're missing out. Sam, have you ever been to the house of fun? Yeah, you have. I've seen you you're standing waiting. in it right now, mate. I've seen you breastfeed from a weed addict's tits. You know you've been there. You went down on a weed lake once. I got it on film. He's got his own weed fuck tape. It's pretty great, really. I love it. The details are. It's, it's called the foliage farm. It's called the red and green. Are you ready? This one is house of fucking fun. Yeah! Ready? Fuck yeah! <laughs> Oh, 
ever seen a last motherfucker one of these cops? You know what the whole world sits city and you're standing in the most fucked up place there is. So hey, shot! People don't know what the fuck they did. I'll tell you what's gonna happen next, the original sin. Are you original sin. sin. Original sin in Sin City is on their fucking original. I just wanna say this, it doesn't matter what you do in your life, people will look down on you, so fuck that. You be you, and you fucking own being Sometimes part of your own world. Sometimes on Sundays, when I dress up in my pigeon outfit, and I'm pulling on the people, they are looking at me funny, but you know, it makes me happy to do this. So I carry on and I go coo, 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 and I'm crying in my pigeon voice. So please, when you see somebody doing this thing, don't laugh. Just give them some Alright, because we're gonna do two songs like straight up, it's gonna be original sin in bloody and hell. I just wanna know how are you feeling there? How are you feeling? You don't look at Mr. Vicky. Is that the only word you got for? You look like you're torn behind those big glasses, mate. Oh, look at Brittany with the paps right in her face. Fucking dead. How are you doing, you slag? No, that's not the answer you're supposed to say, I'm a uh, I'm laugh. Vicky's not having a good night tonight, we can tell. The Vicky didn't touch anyone even appropriately. There were no it's children in the day. audience because of coronavirus, so Vicky's not happy. He's moody, he's moody. He needs to suck at nun's tits. Alright. After the show, Vicar, don't worry about it. I'll put on my nun outfit and bum you. No. Are you ready? This one is original sin, mate. Fuck out! And I don't have a nun outfit, but I'll take a banana and make you feel better. <laughs> Yeah. 
fucking soap girl if it doesn't leave much of the imagination. No. I made it. I made it for you, so don't fucking complain about it. A flap came out to say hello. That's why I made it, so you could flap your flaps, uh, mate. Fly away. If you're not having a good time, you just put it on and flap your flaps and get out. Flap your flaps and yeah. Just one of those days where you don't want to wake up Everything is fucked, everybody's fucked You don't really know why, but you're gonna justify Breaking someone's head off And my gosh, one time there was this pretty pony And it was in a meadow field And it was having such a good time And the other pretty ponies came And fucked it up for the pretty pony <laughs> We hope you're having a beautiful time And no pretty pony can come fuck up your night Shut up, Bulldog. This one is party in hell. No, I'm trying to tune up. Shut the fuck up, man. Fucking hell, I hate when people talking when I'm trying to tune. Shut your whore, man. She's trying to tune up. There you go. Are you fucking ready? Now, the next thing that we're going to do is party in hell. Let's do it, mate. Nah, so how do you mind if we party it up, you cunts? And the third one is...
I haven't been working the streets Wouldn't long enough. Wouldn't be the first time. No, I haven't been, I haven't been working the streets long enough. Him. No, it's this fucking outfit, man. Blessings, <laughs> let's <laughs> clean upon you when you sneeze with the coronavirus. Blessings, blessings be upon you when you are sneezing. Shut your trap. Now the next one that we're going to do is Broken Melody. Oh. Fine, we're going to do demons too. Okay, we're gonna do demons. A broken melody. Oh, you ready? Let's do. Oh, I hate it when people do that. I shit. know, that's why I did it. We're in Sin City. Look at you dressed in your hooker boots. You know, Puss in Boots, the cat, that cat was a dirty dancer, too. It's true, I've seen the tape. Sorry, I hit you on the ass, dude. That's how you greet people where I come from. The strip club. Ow! I'm just joking, I've never been there. Have I ever been in a strip club? Nope. You never have, girl. Yeah, dude. Your bedroom. Oh! <laughs> Come on, that's fucking dumbass. brilliant. This one's <laughs> demons, right? I've been in this whole house, Sam's bathtub. Oh! I'm just joking. Come on. Hold on. Okay, watch. Let me find my notes. <laughs> what? I don't want to straddle it. I don't want to straddle the chair and fuck it, Sam. Sam said, go on the chair, take it down like an annihilation. You know what's missing from this chair? Electricity. Come on. Make my okay, wait, so what are we doing? Joke, We're doing demons. Everyone's got their demons. They fight. Oh, wait, I forgot my fuck. I was just going to stand there singing in the air. Um, <laughs> Everyone's got their demons. They fight. I don't know what someone else's journey is, so don't judge a book by its cover. I mean, if you look at me, you wouldn't realize how amazing I am.
this show like that. What the fuck? Hmm? It's like building a gingerbread house and you leave the gumdrop buttons off. Sometimes that house is supposed to be burned. You a monster, you the witch from Hansel and Gretel. Mm, how did you know? Me and Sam are Hansel and Gretel. You give me Gretel. Gertie. Dirty Gertie. Mm. And now I'm handsome, Hansel. 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 So hot right now. Now the next one we're gonna do is Broken Melody. Broken Melody. It's a very sad song. If you don't growl, I'll kick you in your face. You ready? Oh, uh, dead. Are you ready? The Are you ready? Like this, hanging from Are you ready to? I'd be like smashing it and breaking it and saying, they are fucking ready. Oh, I love that. I'd pay to see that. This guitar means more to me than your life, so shut it. This is very true. This guitar has kept me off the streets. <laughs> I'm just joking. Kept us the your streets. skills have kept us off the streets. Keep playing guitar. I'll keep playing the bass. <laughs> You ready? It's actually fucking funny, man. Sorry, I'm not. I'm not dissing anything. Okay. <laughs> Want you to know how to play the song, yo? You know what to do. Where's the thing? Press it down, put it again on your guitar, come on. I did not understand what you just said. Cause you're dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much for tuning in to tonight's show in Cincinnati. Yeah, you wasn't a genie a whole day. Merci. I sound like a seagull dying in the wind. <laughs> I said hi Sam like a seagull. Why didn't you throw me a chip boy? You chief. <laughs> I said my sister is an asshole in case anyone wanted to know. Thank you. Well it's just built in tune, it's not very good then, is it? Well yeah, now play together so we don't make a mockery of ourselves. It's in England. No, where's Cammy's on the one? I don't know. Should just use what? Test it with my top string. Yeah, the whole was out of tune. <laughs>
Having a fabulous Friday. Are you ready? It's Friday. Friday. It's time to get Friday proud of. It's Friday. So yeah, we hope everyone's having a wickedly beautiful time. If you've ever had to do a job you hated in order to not just survive but pursue an actual dream, then this song goes out to you. It doesn't matter what you do in this life. Never ever be a slave to a system that tells you that just because you do okay, this that you are only it. capable of that. So you can tune if you want to tune your nipples. Always. Oh, Say hello to your mother for me. Oh, I will. <laughs> your mother says hello. Ow. Oh, it was pouring rain, it was raining. Oh, the, today, the song so today when we were in the car was like, It's raining again, ooh baby. I don't know the song, but no, it was pouring again. today. No, and it was fucking raining. So when we got in the car, it was pouring and leaking in the house. And like, Yeah, that sounds fucking new. It's raining. It's so that you guys are idiots. What? Where's the water bucket at? Where's, Where's the, water the water bucket? bucket? Did you take it out? Sam's been Did you take the water bucket out? The water bucket. Oh my god, so the water bucket is there <gasps> and it's oh upside down. Hey, don't touch play, my phone. Can play, play the E strings way? Oh my god. What's the E string? I'm only a bassist, I don't know easy. Shit. Yeah, you're a junior slut. <laughs> She might play guitar, but can't she tune? Only time will tell. I'm only fucking with you, of course she can tune. She tunes me all the time. I'm just saying that's a terrible thing. Can you even play? <laughs> I'm just... There you go. Thank you. <gasps> oh, I had my hat. Can you swim? Okay. With those long legs? <laughs> I can swim to your mother's house and eat all your food. Sam can swim with his long legs. He swims and then eats some lads. That one is called Champagne Go Hey! Thank you. 
Tom and Sharon, Carl, a few people, if they use the right, the F word or whatever, they try and shut them down. Damn, Facebook became so lame. What I mean, F word like fuck or face? <laughs> fuck face? Face fuck. What? Tell me, what do you mean? Oh. Now, man, what do you mean? They're trying to, but are they insane? Like, coming and telling adults what the fuck to do. To it's me, like, if you can't swear... You've got major issues, that's where it's the least of all. You should land the fuck up. Land it low, take a big dump. Walk down the road, take a big thumbs up. And hitchhike to the Milky Way. And hitchhike to the dudes all say. Well, that's hey. why I'm glad what? we're gonna do tomorrow's on YouTube. That was the most fucking beautiful song I've ever written. Tomorrow's live stream will be broadcast through YouTube. Ladies and gentlemen, please plug in your YouTube. Yeah, and subscribe. And, they can swear and you can swear as much as you want. You can even be a cunt. It's okay. All is welcome. All is beautiful. All is great. All is holly. Let's do the song. And this one I'd like to dedicate to Lionel Levendale. Woo! But you can't do that. I'm just saying. Now. And also, remember, breathe. Life is fucking hard, but at the same time, thank you for making it easier for us to breathe. You guys fucking rock. Let's do it. Open your eyes, open up your mind 
secrets that you keep And it's over and done Oh, 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 oh. And you're still running to the tuning into tonight's show. Hey, you missing this amazing acrobatic shoe? Sure, sure wow! Oh. Woo! Eat your heart out. I think I broke my back. <laughs> thank you so much to everyone for tuning in. And again, thank you so fucking much for your support. We fucking appreciate it. I got to piss, do... man. I got to piss. Oh. Why don't you try the drum? No I dare you. I dare you. Come on. Oh, you do. Okay. Yeah. I'm you call in the names? I'm drunk enough. If I I'll, find do it, I'll do it and you do the name. No, same. no, no, no. Let me try. I'll do it and you no, do the name. No, no, you'll break it. No. Uh -uh. Let me do like a voodoo no. thing. No, you'll break I've it. I've never played the drums. I'm not that retarded. No, girl, use the sticks. Okay, fine. Let's go. A sick. I don't have it. <laughs> I can do it with my toes. No, you will break it. I would not do it. Then. I would not. No, I wouldn't. Once, I played once. Yeah, there. Keep your breath up, guys. With your mouth. Okay, here we go. Okay, here we go. Let's do, let's do the kick drum with that. No, it's not. Let's go. Take a big man, burnt out pin, Major Mason, Rob Price, Scott Smith, aka Naked Blue, Dale Levy Wynn, Jeff Collins, Thomas Coca, Andrew Ball, Patrick Saul, John Kovacs, Beverly Uncle, Saiki Kuchi, 
Okay, wait, let me try to find like a cool beat. Dude, I've never, the okay. drums, the instrument that okay. I just don't know fuck all about. I fucking sooner take up a violin than this. And that scares me half to death. Thing with drums. I'm sorry. Okay. Um, it would be the last instrument I ever learned to play. I like the bagpipes, but I don't know shit about drums. I respect all drummers because I can't go, play that. Sam just had to go take a wee. Sam had to go take a wee. Hey, where's my mic? And we should hear it. Oh, yeah, it's on. I just want to say again, sorry for that terrible shit that you heard there with the drums, but I really do not play drums and I don't care. Now my sister's been practicing for years. Listen to the master, I'm just joking, she never played drums either. So we're gonna say hello, Kenneth Fegan, Virgo Queen, Nigel Mason, Rock Grimes, Scott Smith, Dale Laverman, Jeff Collins, Thomas Kunga, woo! And who fuck? Patrick Soul. John Kovacs, Beverly Hassel, Die Kikuchi, Nathaniel White, Peter Kent, Paul Garten, Tom House, Mark, Brandon Photography, Roger Comey, June Fosby, Rob Rizal, Mark Westhead, Laura Hain, Sharon Pickett, Kikuchi Masaru, and Aaron Newman, Kenneth Biggin, Carl Perkins, Ian Hopwood, Michael Johnson, Rich Jury, Benson World, Roy Rich, and Nancy Jury, Adam Coombs, and now Mike Rowe, Tahir Osa, Christopher Neff, Daniel Fuller, Lionel Leventhal, we got Ian Abba, Chris Slater, Alex Wimmingham, Chris Marcy, Kelly Hankerton, Demi Bell. Eric Bat, Peter Cancy, Cornelius Casper again, Scott Sabrana, Free Freeman, Free Walking Horse, Dance it up now. I told you, now. Got the best soap suds, got the best fans in the damn world. Woo! I know what the world was ending, we would all hang out. And you know one thing I really love about all you guys? You all as crazy as us. And it rocks. Cause life is fucked. You might as well be saying I ain't gonna dance. Fuck that. I hate that. Hey. I don't dance. I hate black bitch. What? Woo. We gonna fuck it down. What the fuck kind of beat is that? Are you fucking like? You got your leg broken, girl. Oh. Oh. This guy wishes he had the legs on me. Can, can, 
can you do it? I don't think you can. Can, can, can you do it? I don't think you will. Can, can, can you do it? I don't think you can. Can, can, can you do it? Man, he needs to go. Ow! Thank you for tuning in to tonight's show. I want to show you a cool party trick. Whoa. Did you see that? That was skills. Thank you. <laughs> what? This is what she's playing and she's playing and show your heels. I need to clean up this chair. She Why? Like, eat your blood all over it. So Dead all it. left a trace on you the chair. You got toilet paper. Yeah. I'm joking. No, it's okay. Don't worry about it. No, but you don't want to sit on some toilet paper. Woo! It's okay. It's a black floor. You can't see no lips. Yeah, but still. Damn. Girl, please don't do that. I hate it when people do that. I want to punch the lights out. I'm your father. Exactly. It's <laughs> even worse. I hate when people do that shit. Okay, thank you so much for tuning in to tonight's show. And again, um, yeah, we're going to sit on something back. red, maybe. We're glad Black everyone has a good sense okay. of humor. Black is bad. She's got a period. Her gun is bleeding. Oh, no. She's joking. You're unclean. You need to go. Oh. I'm joking. <laughs> we hope everyone's having a fabulous time. Thank you so much again for y'all crazy sense of humor. And yeah, tomorrow is going to be fun. Tuesday. Tomorrow is super sad spot. I think sins are just created to make people feel bad about being human. Obviously, Obviously don't not, kill. Yeah. And don't, there are certain don't things. I mean, for fuck's sakes, you don't need religion to tell you not to do it. It's but common sense. Exactly. exactly. But even people dressed up in stripper boots, they deserve respect. Exactly. You're just a good person. Okay. <laughs> I can't believe what? that Facebook or any I system can. would so much censorship. block people for, for swearing. Meanwhile, they are... They are Children dying. There are women. That's one thing I also I don't understand. And raped. You, there are men uh, suffering. They're homeless. It, it's insane. You know what it's I don't understand? Up. It's this. So, for instance, on YouTube, you'll see a lot of music videos that are considered mainstream and very popular. And like, let's just take Nicki Minaj and Cardi B and who else, for example, like the Takashi Six One Nine. Six Nine. nine. So um, okay, so six, one, nine. kids from like even some like kids that are 12, 13, 14, they're, they're growing watching up, that. listening to this and watching it, and they do not get censored. The stuff is so explicit, and there's nothing wrong with skin, but it's when your lyrics are super sexual and what you're doing is quite like vulgar, that doesn't get any shit. But anyone that's nude or semi-nude but doing it in a non-sexual context then you get shit for that I don't it's understand. weird i also don't get it it's no, crazy but that's so cool so tomorrow youtube no yeah. walls yeah. no walls the walls will be taken down we will be mexico taking the wall of america down i distanced myself from that statement <laughs> yeah i love mexico so fuck you you I'm heard it there, that. she's anti-Mexico. That's you. the biggest old shit I've ever heard in my life. I, I love, love tacos. Carl, the I merch just, always oh arrives, God. don't worry. What? The, the merchandise always arrives. Yeah, it always arrives, arrives. don't worry. Sometimes always arrives. it's don't super stress. quick. Too. Sometimes it's super quick, other times it takes a while, it depends. But I promise you on my life, one thing about us, we always make sure things get to people when they are going to go to people we don't ever leave things unfinished you if, will get what you ordered we if, promise. if for instance someone um ordered something and like it didn't get to them as soon as they tell us about it we double check what's happened where the glitch is and then it's done but once someone was having a little bit of a hissy fit at me no 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 and i'm gonna explain something and they were getting upset and i just said to them i, I repeated the dress because i had sent it myself and i said is this the dress and then the guy was like oh fuck, i'm so sorry i moved i forgot to update the dress see sometimes glitches happen because something is a little bit wrong but as long as everyone's got patience we chill it's, okay. it's gonna be it's okay gonna sometimes Thank you so much. super quick yeah, sometimes I'm surprised how fast things arrive and then sometimes it's like, fucking hell, what the hell's happening? And I'm the same. When I was in the UK, we don't have Amazon that works here in South Africa. I think there is, but it, it takes forever. Yeah, yeah. But in so England, like things were like arriving the day I ordered or the day after. And I was like, yeah, Amazon, I ordered it online. Where are you? Sam, did you take my little <laughs> I was so excited. Off and I was so excited. No, it must have fallen. <laughs> No, but I, yeah, I would get sure excited. Is. And because I was so used to it, like, arriving so early, then when it didn't, I was like, where is my shit? But some things just take a while. Okay. But it will get to you. But anyway, again, thank you so much, Sharon, for tuning in. We fucking love it. And we hope you're having a wickedly and beautiful Friday. Tomorrow, you'll, they just have to watch your um, YouTube channel 
round about the same time. Same time as tonight's show started, we'll more or less, go yeah. more or yeah. less. We'll go live. <laughs> just tune yeah. in and you tune will in, man. Round about yeah, just past nine. It's gonna be fabulous. South African time. <coughs> yeah, nine o'clock South African time. <coughs> nine p.m. is the same as nine p.m. European time. Um, I think it's 8 p.m. UK time and American time because you have so many time zones, same in Asia and Australia. I do not know. I wish I did. But unfortunately, my blonde brain would not retain that information. Sorry. Okay, can I give it to you? Hell yeah. yeah. Oh, she going to give it to us. Oh. Please, not the big spoon. <laughs> oh, what? Okay. Big spoon is good. Big spoon is smashed. Just joking. Yeah, we hope everyone's having a best time. Was this actually a dance move somewhere people blocked that? I was like, yeah, this. we used yeah. to kids coming. Yeah, no, but we copied that, but like, was that an actual thing? Yeah. Where people thought it was so cool. So there were music videos. People thought it was cool. Yeah. yeah. Didn't they do it for ooh, ooh, ah, ah, <coughs> sexy eyes? Come on. That one. Maybe. Damn. Oh, take it. Okay. Oh, just fine. We'll take Thank it. Thank you. Save me on camera. Run. Oh, my God. I'm <laughs> Hello. Ooh. Yes, thank you very, very much, man. Um, no, in South Africa, in the winter, um, I think in the UK winter, you guys are two hours behind. But right now, in the summer, you guys are one hour behind. And that is an absolute fact. So, there you go. Same. Now, what else is happening here? And hey, Billy, thank you so fucking much. We hope you're having a wickedly beautiful evening. And thank you, Tom. Oh, my God. Thank you. We hope you're having a wicked time, too. What? Nothing. Oh, shit. Jam of the month problems. So yeah, thank you. And we're really fucking grateful to have you all in our lives. Thank you so much for like supporting us, spreading the word, watching the show, being part of everything we do. Girl, can you come close? Yeah, girl, sorry. It's just kind of, you know what I mean? Oh, fuck. But you're not in the camera, then it's okay. like, I'm the only one. I'll just hold it out. Oh, shit. And blondes are very smart. Well, I get blondes a bad day. So, been doing that since I was born. Now, a line of t-shirts named... Give blondes a bad name. Oh, it's Christoph says a line of t-shirts named Beefy for heavyweight fabric. The weight is heavier than typical library. Ah, ah kick ass. The Beefy. Those are Beefy shirts. Except if you made underwear called Beefy, then people think it was like beef curtains. Yeah, maybe. You could that's make a line like that. Oh, sorry. Yeah. I have set the reminder on your YouTube channel. Ah, oh, that's so sweet. Thank you. That's a clever idea, Chris. And the swim Dumb dance. dance. Oh. I'm a smart than I am blonde. Ah, oh, rock on. I can never thank you enough. Ah, oh, well, Patrick, we thank you. Thank, thank you, you very, very fucking much, man. Un grand bisou toujours. Toujours. Et merci infiniment pour votre soutien. And let's see what's happening here, too. Thanks for kicking off the weekend and stuff. Well, thank you very much, Dan. And yeah, we fucking have energy thanks to you guys. And we are super passionate about what we're doing because we love it. And we fucking <laughs> dig you guys too. I think it's the same, like, there's a show in the UK. It's called The Mighty Boosh. And I love the craziness and the quirkiness of it. It was from 2007. And I think even though it was done then, like now... It, you wouldn't be able to say some of the shit because it's just un unapologetic. And it's like an, a completely different universe. I dig it. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't but have to. It fucking makes me happy and I dig it. Mm -hmm. So we're glad to be like a space for other people like that is a space for us. 10 degrees in the UK today. Ooh. Oh. Fucking hell. Hold this. I'll tell you how many degrees it is here. Here it's kind of supposed to be spring but the spring takes a while to start and right now as it stands I'm just scrolling it. What? Why did you go so up? Why not? Oh my god. Um, right now it is 12 degrees and it is raining. So we're three oh. degrees warmer than you guys, but we're supposed to be fucking warm right now. I think the weather's going to get better soon. Today was raining like a flood. They say it's going to rain tomorrow again. I too. know. And it was raining in the house. No, it wasn't again. raining tomorrow. That's what tomorrow's they say. raining? Fuck off. That's what they say. It's going to uh, rain tomorrow. Tomorrow's nice and sunny. And Sunday too. Oh. It was meant to rain. I think it rained all the rain it was supposed to. It was like a sponge that just didn't want to stop squeezing. Spongy. Ew. Mm. You're disgusting. Um... Okay, well, we'll check it out. Just give us a moment to check that out, Carl, and thank you for letting us know. Thank you. And another fantastic show. Wow, thank, thank you, you very, very much, much, Daniel. be great if the UK crowd arranged to go to a certain gig and sell it out for you on the next show. That I would be so sick. fucking <laughs> sick. I think it would be wicked, man. Like, it would just be one hell of a party. That's for sure. That would be fucking insane. And also, I have blonde moments, and I've never been blonde. <laughs> hey. Everyone does. My life is a blonde moment, man. I enjoy it. And also better than luminous white trousers on stage though. Ooh, that could be pretty cool. Like, you know, if we had like glow in the dark paint, it would be sick. Mm. And also, did someone strength? 
What does that mean? And thank you so much for the epic show. Oh, well, thank you, Thomas. We fucking love you too. Ah, you enjoyed seeing us on the drums. <laughs> I can't play drums for shit. Neither can I. Fucking hell, man. Um, but also, thank you very much, Robert. The Mighty Boosh is fucking hilarious. I dig it. Um, I've never liked the Mighty Boosh. Didn't really find it funny at the time. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's one of those things. It again. I, I dig obscure, weird Look things. Look at the, the, the episode called Old Greg. Funny. Well, the crack box. It's so crazy. That's why I love it because it doesn't make me feel like I'm in a normal world. Yeah. And loving the green makeup. Ooh. Thank you, Rob. Never mind the red. I thought it was pink. <laughs> it's red. Oh. And <laughs> times in the USA for tomorrow's show on YouTube. 3 p.m. Eastern, 2 p.m. Central, 1 p.m. Mountain, 12 p.m. Y'all heard it here first. Thank you Fucking so much, Fucking hell. Mom. That's so crazy how many different time zones. Know, you know, in Russia, I think there's... 10 or 11 different time zones. No wonder they drink vodka. Or maybe it's from yeah. drinking vodka. Um, it's crazy. You know that Jimmy um, Kalias guy? This this big fucking cunt wank. Um, wh- what does he say? He says, yeah, most hoes love what they're doing. Fucking this and fucking that. I'm sure that things that are just as nasty go in those mouths that come out of them. Well, isn't it funny? You seem to know a lot about it, Jimmy Kalias. Yeah, you know you know what's crazy? That you often come onto the live streams and spew your shit. You should close your legs like you should close your mouth because the shit that's emanating out of your orifices stinks. And maybe just buy a belt instead of wearing those abrasive things. Because you look like an old pedophile. Yeah. And it's gross. Anyway, and I'll bring straw waffles in your back. Oh, uh, yes, again. Thank please, you. Thanks Rob, so much, Rob. Love and hey, get a minute. We fucking love you. And we are getting spinning images back on BritBox. It's a show that has been away for too long. Oh. Ooh, record. Never seen it. We need to check it out. And then thank me, you, Chris. Thank you very much, Chris. No need to bother yourselves. You updated me on the fanny shirts already. Don't bend over backwards again. Oh, my God. That's fucking hilarious. Uh, thank you, Carl. Katie. Oh, okay. And Anthony says, I think you guys I need to get pen, Sammy the Crab. Sky. Oh my God. Remember Sammy the Crab from oh the Muddy Bush? Yes. I fucking loved it. Guest appearance. I was fucking mm-hmm. it. It's just such a crazy, like, interesting, like, zany universe. That's what I love about it. And thank you for another great show, ladies. We found out here in Cardiff, South Wales, as of 6 p.m. on Sunday, we are back in lockdown. Uh... Oh, fuck, man. Well, you know what, Gareth? Don't stress. We're going to like make you guys smile and laugh no matter what. So, again, we're in this together. We also, we all fucked. I mean, the only good thing that you can take from this lockdown is that around the world, everyone else is also fucked. I mean, it would be so shit. Imagine you were in the only country where like you weren't able to be free. You know what's really hilarious? What? This, you know, I was just busy thinking what, about it. That dude called Jimmy Kalias or whatever. Yeah, he's like, a dick. the world is already fucked up right now. Like, and people you should are just have a shitty space. Like, like, why do you want to add to it? You should have a muzzle put on him and tase it until he dies. It's so stupid. Why, stupid, why the fuck do you want to add to it? You, you you look like you've already lived enough in your life and maybe it's time to pass on. Like you're old enough to know the Stop difference it. between being a cunt and being a cunt. See, a lot of people shout at kids for being bullies, but imagine being an adult bully. It's disgusting. It's disgraceful. And you missed my wombat hole comment. Oh my God. Oh, I saw it. It was fucking hilarious, Sharon. It was bloody brilliant. I need to show you. This is an Australian you know, just co- a condom me, commercial. Please, mate? Um, and also, no offense, you know, you know, when I make jokes about calling people hoes and sluts and whores and that, the only reason I'm doing it is because it's, it's so the most ridiculous, ridiculously <laughs> preposterous word I can, can think of. On the wall, right? Imagine, and um, thank you, Katie. Oh, ah. imagine dissing people for having a lot of sex. Like, what the actual fuck? Like, humans are such weird creatures. I know, because I mean, they'll watch people doing it, but then call the people no I wouldn't do that no 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 I'm saying. not saying I'm saying usually the people that call other people that they watch like Dodgy fucked up shit or whatever and yeah and, and then they judge God. other people thank you thank, thank you, thank you very thank much car. thank you can you see your name get a car so yeah people calling other people sluts and that I just think it's hilarious because it's so when bloody when you call vulgar, other shocking. people stuff it doesn't make you any anything less person. yeah it doesn't make you less of what you're calling other people so, you're just you. an oxygen slut Opening your big trap, trying to steal it all. Putting so your fuck stink off. in the air. Yeah. Now, anyway, I wish there was a deodorant for haters. And yeah. then you just sprayed them out. So, anyway, let's see. You would have fitted better in the Mighty Boosh than robots and disguise you in it. Ah, <laughs> rock on. Oh, thank you. I love it. And also, Chris, we hope you're well. And, and yes, tomorrow's show is on YouTube. Live. And also, thank you for another fantastic Friday night out. Oh, oh, my God, man. Thank you so fucking much, Roy. I think we just do what we would want to see ourselves, like from another band. We can't band. wait to see you live at a show again. It's like, going to be fucking yeah. amazing. 
Um, but yeah, I don't know. I just wish that we knew like more about like when the world would settle down. But we are gonna never stop being who we are. We'll so always be in your family. You got no choice, all of you. So yeah, fuck it. We're gonna ride this craziness together. And hey Craig. Um, and hey Scott, what's up? What's up, crazy lover? I'm back at you, Millie. Have you done the Kelly Slater move yet? Almost. Yes, I have. Oh no, you did do it. Sorry. Almost. Fuck you. Are. Tomorrow I'm gonna do it. If I break my back, I hope you know it's your fault. <laughs> I'm just joking. I'll do it tomorrow. And I can't fucking wait. No, I'm I'm just funny like that. I'm not usually sporty or athletic with anything. So when it comes to gymnastics or anything like that, that's the only time I really enjoy a sport and I like it. So if I can't do it, I go insane until I do it. She had to beat me with the broom to do it. <laughs> I hope you're happy. Sure, it was great fun, really. She beat my back. Cleaned her out out. <laughs> You'll see it tomorrow. Okay. I'm... Oh, yes, Jeff. I do remember that show. It Hilarious. happened in Italy. Yeah, it was fucking hilarious. It's man. happened to me in quite a few shows, actually. I think it's cool to ble- bleed freely. Some people, and then, oh my God, in Italy. And thank you, remember, Laura. And then the people came up to me afterwards, and they're like, how did you do it? It's so artistico. Then it was like fake and blood shooting out of it. And then they put it on their face outfit. like this, and I was like this, oh my God. And I was just like, yeah, it's a little um, little pouch, and then it's fake blood. Nah, I bleed freely. I think it's fine. Yeah. Anyway, because it's natural, whatever. Um, and Sam has got a cold, but so hopefully he'll be better tomorrow. Shame, man. Uh, somebody had to tease you with the video, so you're added to the painting. Yes. Yeah, oh, rock on, man. And you're also, fucking good at painting. Yeah, we'll say that, man. You got skills. Mm-hmm. I think it's so fucking sick when people just try things and I don't know, you guys just give it a go. Draw, paint, do something you enjoy, man. How do you feel about having Sharon Pickett as your Aussie tour manager? Hey, hey rock on, man. We fucking sick. Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. Oi, oi, oi. Oh, my God. You gone full on Aussie, eh? Hey? Fucking have, mate. Yeah. Hey. Okay, and many thanks for the share. Well, thank, thank you, you very, very much, much, Carlo. And we are not all fucked. I'm not fucked at all, which is a great tragedy. Oh, uh, my God. Hey, you've never seen never the like, mate. I'm just joking. Um, said art is amazing. Oh, thank you. Yeah, thank we fucking you. dig it, man. Tomorrow's gonna be fun. Tomorrow's a suicide squad. I don't even know anything about so it. Suicide squad, you better watch the movie, mate. I should. Oh, I didn't know it was a movie. Um, oh, sweet. Thank you so fucking much, Robin. Check it out. Thank you. And I got videos of a kiwi chick who loves to tease herself with a cattle prod. Woo, oh my damn. God. Oh my god. I couldn't even imagine the pain. Oh god. But it just shows mind of a matter, man. A deheaderant. That's a fucking <laughs> sick name, Tunch. Um, I think you said somewhere that Nomi made yeah, that shirt into a onesie. Yeah, she did, actually. It's fucking it's like sick. like a bodysuit. Yeah, I love it. No chip teeth today. Yeah. And exactly. Rock on. We've got really interesting underwear. So go check it out on our merch page. And funny thing is, as a guy, you get dissed for not yeah, fucking around that's with women's opposite. To me, like, look, yeah. Okay. I, I'm very funny. I had my first kiss at like 22 or 23. I can't actually remember the number. And I just, I found it funny because I was called a whore. I started all kinds of things just based off how I dressed from when I was young, from when I was like 12 years old. And I just found it fucking fascinating. I don't understand what the problem is. That's not the way that I am to do things like that. But if people do sleep around, Sound prerogative. Good on you, None man. Your business either way. What what does it change or make of a person? Do you, do you know what I mean? No. But it, it's so crazy that people find Just that like exercising, like saying, "Oh, you like exercising a lot." Okay, cool. Wow. Well, okay. Doesn't but make you any better or worse, worse than, than anyone, anyone else. else like so. I, society has a unless strange that person's mentality. like going around and hurting people, then that's different. Yeah, but I'm not being rude. It it doesn't. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe it's to take away attention from the fact that they're not getting any. But I don't know. I don't know. Um, People yeah. are mostly very strange. In shit ways, though. Do you sip your guitar ah. picks? Ones. This one's a bit uh, worn down, though, and it's a bit fucked up. Hey, there. and Shalomville. And how about doing a Rudy and Spider theme show? Oh, we need to check oh. that out. That would be so fucking cool, Sharon. I love seeing places in a country that are not just touristic because otherwise you just feel like you're only seeing a certain part of a place. So it's always good when you get someone that lives in a place to show you around. Thank you. During oh a gig, God, I played 92, Perkins. got on a table where some of his friends were. He fell on the table, knocked the tooth out. Oh, fuck. <laughs> you know I'll never forget that shit. Carl, you know you know sometimes when fucked up shit happens, at the time it's horrific and people are like, What the fuck? But those stand in your mind as like an insane memory. 
and they end up being like things of legend. That's this fucking sick, man. And huge compliment coming from you. Oh no, man, it's no, fucking you're true. Really good at painting. Um, that's so fucking cool, Carl. Are they still friends? That's what I want to know. <laughs> Um, well, exactly, Stag. I, I just, I don't understand it, but I just think people need to, like, stop being so um, judgmental of other people's business. I mean, fuck it, leave them. But anyway, I think the Enchantress from the Suicide Squad is close to my ideal woman. Oh, I need to check that out. I'm going to check it out. It is when it rules the world and where rule blood peters. That is actually true. You know, one thing I find really interesting, like, one thing about myself personally is this. I love people that are comfortable enough in their own skin to not give a fuck about what other people think so for me i enjoy being nude or as close to naked as possible not for any other reason than it's just how i feel comfortable i mean take a swim without clothes you feel so free and then when you wear something again you feel like restricted feels so like you're being weighed down i hate the fact that when you are like let's say not wearing much and you you like sing really vulgar or provocative things people will leave you alone and say it's okay but when you're just like not wearing much and you're not there to be like sexual people have such a big issue with it it's almost like they can't stand the fact that you've taken away the sexuality from what they perceive nudity or near nudity should be and i hate that i think more people should just be like fuck it i wear what i want and that's okay very true. I love the fact that at our shows, everyone from any the age same, even takes though, their clothes off and they're like, yeah, and there's no, no one's looking at you weird. No one's trying to be perverted. Even it's though you know normal. at school, don't you think it's so funny and weird? Like that just because another, just say like you get all different kinds of um, kids that are interested in different things. Yeah. And just because a, like say a kid is interested in Star Wars or whatever. I don't know. Maybe now it's different. <clears throat> but then they immediately dubbed as like a nerd or uncool. But like who says that though? I did. When I saw the kids playing with the lunchboxes like they were sabers. No, I but beat so, those kids. I think it's so I'm crazy joking. that from such a young age, it's ingrained to us to think that we're better than other people. I also agree. It's I think stupid. it's stupid. But anyway, I think when you close your mind off to things um, without trying them first, you just... You're limiting yourself. You're limiting yourself. It's the same. Like, this is the thing that makes me laugh the most. Um, I mean, look, if you eat meat, that's good for you. If you don't, whatever. So... Like you'll see a lot of the, a lot of the times on like vegetarian or vegan things, there'll be vegetarian um, like beef jerky or vegetarian jerky or whatever, or in South Africa built on. So people will say, "Oh, why if, do they need it then? If it's um, if if meat is so bad, then why do vegetarians want food that tastes like meat?" But the thing is, this some people are vegetarian not because they hate the taste of meat. In fact, they love it and they grew up with it. But it's just they don't like the cruelty that goes with it. So it's just like these people don't they they can't see it from a different perspective do you know what i mean I, and i think that's the problem with the world you're so used to seeing things from your own no, way but i think the biggest mistake with people is that they think their opinion is the the only one and the right one yeah and that's wrong i think you should always be open to other people's ideas i mean don't get me wrong i laugh like when i see any friend eating bread with tomato sauce and cheese and i'm like what the fuck but we laugh and when they see me eating like um, porridge with like lumps in it. I fucking love that shit. Then they're like, dude, what the fuck? And we laughed. But it's great when you're comfortable enough in who you are to not want to change how someone else is. Just be you, man. It's the same. Some people are conservative. Some people aren't. Just leave Whatever. them. As long as no one tries to force another person to be their way. It's or good. to make you feel shit just because you aren't like them. Yeah. And Daniel says, I'm learning to avoid the touristy areas and face off to hey. you. Oh, that's so fucking sick, man. I think that's the best thing you can do. Even if you come over to South Africa or you go into, like, I know, Touristy for instance, places sometimes are cool, but they're a bit, I don't know, everyone's done it. Yeah, so. it's nice. Like, don't get me wrong, but if you do things that local people would do, you'd find a different view of the mm. place you're in. Not always. I mean, sometimes, look, come on, what, do you want to avoid going to the Eiffel Tower? Gotta get that pay. And the Coliseum in Rome, it was worth it. We didn't pay to go in, but we looked we were it. outside and we went We around. peeped on it. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, but anyway, um, forgive me for being a bit risque tonight, but I would like to say this. If God was a big vagina, this guy would be in church every day. Oh <laughs> my God, that's fucking hilarious, man. <laughs> being naked is awesome. It is a free yeah, feeling. Yeah, it's not sexual at being... Yo, exactly. But society has to sexualize it in order to make it like profitable. You see, that's why nudity is so taboo. It's crazy. I mean, for me, like, I, I just don't care about other people being naked. It's their business. 
Um, and hey, Jack, thank you very much. Yeah, the COVID is a fucking nightmare, but we will see you again. And don't stress. And there's a scene in a film called Superbad where girls... Oh, I realize that. Yeah, I've seen that part. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Who told us about that, Sam? I've, no, I saw it. Oh my god, fuck sex is brilliant. <laughs> really bad at taking compliments. Same goes for gift. No, but you see, because you've got such a big heart that you, I don't know, you prefer to give than like accepting things. But yeah, hey, you should watch the Suicide Squad thing. I'm gonna check it out tomorrow. And are they still friends? Actually, his friend left home, and as far as I know, they've never been in contact again. Oh. Oh, they should reconnect, man. What's a what's a tooth between friends? If I chipped out your tooth, would you hate me? No. You would, Just you would for the moment, me. I would, but then I would be like, whatever. Yeah. You're paying for my new tooth. <laughs> oh, exactly. <gasps> um, forgive me. Wait, I always saw that. Um, take nerd as a compliment, though. I like all kinds of fantasy and comics and games. It's cool, though. Then you have a great I'm not a nerd. I'm more of a dog, but yeah, fuck it. Um, and I get branded and nerd. Ah, fuck that, well, man. You're the smartest nerd, then. You're the coolest nerd I know, Daniel. <laughs> then I must be, too. Nerds rule. Exactly. Mm-hmm. I dig it. Um, I'll send you some spitting image codes. Oh, that's so sweet. Thank you, Jeff. And what else happening here? I would love still being a geek. My contemporaries who weren't probably just watch TV now. Exactly. I think it's cool. I love things that are unusual. Um, and I, I find that most like people that are labeled nerds or like dogs or weirdos or whatever, we're all like free thinkers, mm. if that makes sense. We do what we enjoy, even if other people don't get it. Yeah, hey, we can't night, fucking wait. Good night, Chris, and good night, Ken. Germany is the nicest town and city I've ever true. been. Oh my god, I love it. It's so much fun, man. Et bonne nuit à vous aussi, Patrick. Faites de bons rêves et merci infiniment. Gros bisous et énorme hugs aussi à vous. And my spinning class was quite challenging tonight, so I should have an earlier night. Oh my hey, god, good night, Tom. We gonna see you guys tomorrow. Yes. Yes. See you tomorrow. Thank you Super very, Squad. very much for tuning in. We hope you guys have a wickedly beautiful rest of the day, morning, evening, like whatever it's like time it time. is. And we'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Thank you for everything. And also, don't let anything get you down. Seriously, just it's gonna be okay. And my bass player's wife tried to find the guy for his fiftieth birthday oh, party. Shit. Oh shit. Uh, oh. That happens though, but fuck it. We hope he's okay. Imagine he hasn't fallen off the grid and he's still holding a grudge to this day and he's like, he's planning an attack. A tooth for a tooth. And he keeps replaying it back, the thing. And then he has that song in his head and then when he sees you guys, he's going to be like, You will pay. <laughs> when y'all get the new PO box and me, it be okay for sure, Stack. And I, I got to the gig late tonight. Oh, uh, hey, Paul, what's hey, up? What's hey. up? We hope you're having a fabulous Friday. And Nerds great, are smart true. and creative. True. True shit. Um, always like making your laugh. Well, you do. Thank you. Thank you very much. And what else is happening here, and man? dreams, everybody. We hope you have wickedly sweet dreams. I almost said nightmares. And then I was like, that's not <laughs> no, very good. So nice, yeah. And thank you, Tunch. Thank, thank you, Sharon. You. How about a Revenge of the Nerds theme? We could, Ooh, We yeah. were thinking of doing like a Wayne's World one. I'm a nerd that when it comes to something I'm proud of. Yeah, well, exactly. I think it's fucking Knowledge sick, man. Exactly. Good night, Simone. Good night. Good night, Garrett. Sweet dreams. Good night, Carlo. We'll see you tomorrow. Good night, Craig. Good night, Rory. Good night, Jeff. We love you guys. Sweet dreams. Thank you for everything. And see you soon. See you tomorrow on YouTube. Hey, don't forget, don't forget YouTube. YouTube live streaming tomorrow. And 80s theme again. Yes, we're going to sure. do it. And good night, Jim. Good night, Sharon. Bye. Good night. Bye. Thank you. Thank Hello. you again. Bye. Bye.